This next guy, they're gonna love him. He performs all over Chicago. Give it up for Steven Springer. Anthony forgot my main credit. 2014 winner of the Mr. Potato Head Look Like contest. <laughs> You should see me with the top hat and the pipe. Yeah. That's some ugly competition. But uh, I had a great day today. I went to a funeral. No big deal. I had another guy. I went for the funeral buffet. See, go, go, go in comedy, I don't make a lot of money, as you soon find out why. So I like to scan the obituaries. <laughs> if I'm in the mood for Chinese food, I look for names like Wayne or Chong. <laughs> if I'm in the mood for Italian food, I look for uh, Russo or Rizzo. And guess what I do if I'm thirsty? O'Reilly or O'Malley. <laughs> if anybody asks how I know the deceased, I just start crying. <laughs> Who wants to see a fat man cry anyways? <laughs> I love working out. Not doing it, watching it. <laughs> My high-rise apartment building's got a gym in it. People actually take the elevator to use the Stairmaster. <laughs> I like to walk behind them eating a chili dog. You break a sweat your way, I'll break a sweat mine. <laughs> Speaking of how I look, you're not gonna believe this, but my dad's actually a plastic surgeon. <laughs> Apparently I'm gonna have to look like this till I get my grades up. <laughs> Tell you the truth, he just likes to use me for his before pictures. Specialties breast enlargements. <laughs> what am I gonna do with a bigger set of breasts? Stay home, play with them? I love the one he brought us work home with him. He thought I wanted to be a plastic surgeon like him. I just want to see breasts. They do. My parents divorced. I told you my dad liked to bring his work home with him. One day my mom caught him in bed taking action pictures. <laughs> Ducky yellow, huh? Since the divorce, my mom's discovered uh, internet dating. My 74 year old mom. Now thanks to site like, uh, sites like Senior People Meet and creepyoldpeople.com. <laughs> my mom's actually getting more action than me. You know the only problem? My mom doesn't drive. So get this, I gotta drop her off on Saturday nights at the guy's house. Pick her up Sunday morning. It's kind of awkward, but what else do I have to do on a Saturday night? Besides, uh, I can't have my mom doing the walk machine. Now with her arthritis, it would be the walker machine. Get this, when I pick her up on Sunday morning, drive her home, she has me take her to the back of her building to avoid embarrassment in front of the neighbors. <laughs> me, she doesn't care. I just discovered internet dating myself, but you know what the hard part is? Cutting out my prime date from the picture. <laughs> I don't get a lot of second dates, and I think I figured out why. First dates. <laughs> Apparently I changed a lot since 1982. <laughs> I did get a second date once so with this 73-year-old. Uh, 
She had Alzheimer's, so every day was a first day. She thought I loved sex, but she was loaded. And I was just thinking heart attack. We finally broke up. She kept trying to fix me with her, fix it so that I could hang out with her eyebrow friends. Look at me, I'm lucky to have unibrow friends. Now I hear she's dating a 40 year old, isn't that child abuse? <laughs> Even tried a site called www.airforromance.com. It's where you meet white black women. But, anyways, uh, you know the saying once you go black, you don't go back? I went black and they don't want me back. <laughs> I did meet this one nice girl there, though. She, uh, beautiful, great personality, worldly. Penis kind of threw me off. <laughs> I'm Steven Springer, if you like my act. If you didn't like it, I'm Jerry Springer. He can take it. Here we go for Steven Springer, you guys.